I'm Madame Donut, and I own Donut Dynamite with my husband. I always loved donuts. My very first job was actually uh, at Dunkin' Donuts when I was 15. I, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. But, um, uh, but at the time, I did not make the donuts. I, I worked the front of the house. Um, but I think my awareness of donuts kind of came about around that time. I look at the donut as my canvas, and I express my creativity through it, I express my story, even my life story on a donut. Um, I think it's so lucky that we're able to do it because I, I imagine any creative person or any artist would love to create something the way I'm creating the donut and make a living off of it. We have over 20 different kinds of brioche. So our workday usually starts somewhere around 10 p.m. to midnight. I mix the dough um, and then basically let it sit in the refrigerator in a cool room for about uh, six to eight hours to let the butter set. Meanwhile, while that's going on, we have all sorts of other projects like the toppings and such. We cut them, we proof them, we fry them, we cool them, we glaze them. By the time all of these are done, usually it would be around 5 o'clock in the morning when we box our donuts. When it comes to flavor, don't skimp out. Because when you're happy about what you're eating, I think that's a healthy feeling, a healthy attitude. I was once asked, hey, you're going to be in business. Are you fulfilling a need or a want? And I said, I'm fulfilling a want. I express myself through donuts. I think donuts are very humble and also they're the underdog of the pastry world. If you look at what most people are doing, they're just putting some really cool, fun toppings for shock value, if you will. A lot of times I think it's too much, it's overdone. But when somebody walks in here, it's like, oh my God, a donut! And like the face, that excitement, it's like, oh my God, this is so good. Nobody says that about Sally. I'm so sorry that that's the truth. But people come in here and they get so excited and just look at me like, oh my God, thank you so much for doing what you do.